everybody. It's Jess here with Lush Jess. Thank you so much for watching another week of summer lunches, our second week. Nate is hanging out with me right here because he is ready to eat. Nate, why don't you go sit down? I'm going to bring it to you. So <laughs> welcome, you guys. Every day I'm going to show you guys what I feed my kids during the summer. I do have a little baby, 16-month-old baby, but he's already in bed. He had a quick little hurried together lunch and he's in bed. But I will show you what I make my kids and how much of it they eat. These are just really simple and easy things that don't take me long to throw together. It's things they'll actually eat. And we keep it fun. We always have fun food Friday or fun lunch Friday. So stay tuned for that. Today is Monday, however, and our school did um, summer lunch like pickups today. They're doing it every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So we're going to pick them up to support the school. And it's a huge blessing. Um, in terms of getting food and um, if you have that in your area I would recommend seeing if you qualify to get it because it really does help the school offer it to more and more families okay right. so let me show you guys what they have today um, a lot of the lunches that we pick up the kids don't always like and so we'll eat them or they'll eat bits and pieces of it that doesn't ever go to waste so let me show you what they have today so this is Nate's lunch. He definitely will drink the milk from the school. I made him a little strawberry fruit cup. This is a cheese quesadilla I just cut up into pieces for him. And then he has some Doritos. For Lucy, she's having more of the school lunch. She's having... <laughs> Here, Nate, you want to take it? Do two hands. Two hands. Are you happy with your lunch? Okay. Yes. Two hands. He's going to drop it. All right. I'll bring it right to you. For Lucy... She's having broccoli and carrots. It also came with ranch, but she said, no, I don't want ranch. Whatever. Oh, you got it? Carrots and broccoli. She also has some Doritos. I made her a fruit cup with strawberries and blueberries. And then she has a milk, and I put some pepperoni on her plate for a little bit of protein. So after they eat, we'll show you how much of this they ate. All right, you guys. So here's how the kids did. Nate ate all but three bites of his quesadilla. I don't know why. <laughs> he drank his milk, he ate his fruit, all that. Lucy ate most of her veggies, but there's still a little bit. That was a lot. She wanted both of bags, so I'll save the rest and she can eat on, eat on them for a snack. Oh, you, she's come back for the broccoli. <laughs> she has three pepperonis left, and she also ate a cereal bar. She had swimming lessons. Actually, she's having them all week, and so she's going to be pretty hungry after that, so... Anyway, we'll see you guys back tomorrow. All right, everybody, welcome to Tuesday. Let me show you what the kids have. Mark could not hang. He had to go to sleep. So I fed him a little bit of leftover shells and cheese and some chicken, and he is in bed. <laughs> Let me show you what the big kids have. So I made some homemade pizzas um, using some help from Aldi with the ba mini bagels. So these mini bagels I got in a big pack at Aldi. And then I just cut them down. The, well, you know, they're already pre-cut. But opened them up. Put some sauce and cheese. And then on Nate's, he has pepperoni. So Lucy has two bagels here. Pizza. She just likes cheese. She has an apple and some cheddar Pringles. And then this juice from is from the school. They sent it yesterday. It is fruit punch. And then for Nate, he has the pizza. I'm going to cut his into bite-sized pieces. It'll be easier to, for him to eat. Um, so he's got three of them with a juicy juice fruit punch, cheddar Pringles, and he doesn't really like apples, but he does like applesauce. So he's going to have this go-go squeeze apple strawberry. So that's their lunch for today, and we'll see how much of it they eat. All right, you guys. Boom. Everything is gone. Um, Lucy told me this is like one of her new favorite things, and they inhaled it. So I guess the bagel pizzas were good idea for today. Um, I also have done it before where I made a bunch of them up and then before I baked it, I just threw them in the freezer and then when I wanted them, you know, for lunch or whatever, I just pulled them out already ready to go. But these are just made, you know, a few at a time. So you could do it either way. And, um, they're a lot better than the bagel bites cause they're like fresher. They don't, they don't get as hard and like chewy as the bagel bites do. Anyway, it was a success. We'll see you guys back for Wednesday next. All right, friends, welcome to Wednesday's lunch. Let me show you what the big kids have today. Mark is already eating. He's eating some beans, cheese, grapes, milk, a little bit of chicken too. He's just having a little bit of everything. 
Um, so we did get another lunch from the school today. So I'm going to be incorporating that throughout the lunches and dinners that we have uh, for the next couple days. For Nate, I did chicken. So I want to show you guys this bag. This is the one we get from Aldi and the one he likes. Tyson has a very similar one. Um, so if I don't get to Aldi, I'll get that one. But it's the... Oh yeah, it's the honey batter tender. So I just cooked about six or seven in the air fryer, cut them up into pieces for him. He has some ketchup to dip. And then he has some sun chips, a milk, and a couple of Oreo thins. So that is his lunch. For Lucy, Mark is so ready for a nap. For Lucy, she has some pepperoni, some sun chips, some raisins, some carrots, and she's having chocolate milk. My kids aren't huge on chocolate milk, but she likes it every now and then. So this is what they have for Wednesday, and we'll see you guys back when they get done to see how they did. All right, you guys, everything's gone. They ate it all. It's all gone. <laughs> so we'll see you guys. Even your milk. We'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, everybody, welcome to Thursday. Let me show you what the kids have today. Mark's already started eating. He's having shells and cheese just like Nate. He's very fussy. It's almost uh, nap time. So I made shells and cheese for... Nate and Mark, they both love the pasta roni shells and cheese. Nate also has a apple strawberry applesauce from Aldi. Yeah. Some Oreo Thin, the golden kind. And then a Kool-Aid squeeze juice. Lucy is just coming in from swimming lessons. But she has a Go-Gurt. That's so cute. Go-Gurt, ham rolls, Pringles. Uh, cucumbers, tomatoes, a little cup of grapes, and a juice. So that's what they have today. We'll see you guys back when you, they, well, almost said when they get home, when they get finished, and uh, we'll see how they did. All right, you guys, so they did great. Nate ate everything. Lucy um, changed out her juice for a milk, for a milk. Sorry about that. And she wanted to save her go gurt for later. So, other than that, everything else is gone. And we're going to have a little rest time. So we'll see you guys back tomorrow for Fun Lunch Friday. All right, you guys. Welcome to Friday. So before I show you the lunches, every time I start filming, Mark starts crying. Before I show you the lunches, I want to show you what I decided to do for Fun Lunch Friday. This does not take any extra, like, groceries or extra money or extra anything. I literally made a menu for them to check off themselves what they wanted. And I just used, like, the stuff I already had and <laughs> put on the menu. So I didn't buy anything for this. Um, I literally went through the pantry and thought, what can I put on the menu for them? So, actually, this one is Nate's. And this one is Lucy's. Now, Nate started filling out his menu, and he started, like, loving to check everything after he already chose. So some of this is not actual what he wanted. He was just checking off things because it looked fun. But when I went through it with him, he selected pizza for his entree. For his side, he selected chips. And then milk and Oreo thins. So that's what he wants. Lucy was like, this is the best thing ever. I mean, she was like, can we do this every Friday? So she selected chicken and she wanted to let me know that she wants the balls. That's the popcorn chicken, not the, not the nuggets, the balls. So she selected chicken, gogurt, grapes, chips, juice, and an ice cream bar. All right, you guys, I'll see you guys back at lunch when I have everything ready and nobody else is crying. All right, everybody, we are ready to eat. The kids have been in here a hundred times ready for lunch. <laughs> let me show you real quick what it looks like so you guys already knew what they pick so i did a party pizza for nate and just this is like half of one um sausage and pepperoni and i will cut it up a little bit more in bite-sized pieces that's just how he it's easier for him to eat and uh, but it's really hot right now so he's got the pizza his oreos his chips his milk everything that he checked and then lucy wanted popcorn chicken gogurt grapes chips and juice and then she has her ketchup and then when she's ready um, we'll get her her ice cream but of course we're gonna leave that frozen for now so when they get done eating we will show you how they did mark has already eaten he um could not wait so he had some cheese and some gogurt and some applesauce a little bit of chicken just like a little bit of everything that while well, i was making this so we'll see you guys when they get done eating all right you guys so they did really good nate ate everything i even gave him another piece of pizza and he ate that too so he did good um 
Oh, somebody turned on the TV. And then Lucy said she got full before her go-go. So we'll save that for later. And she's still gonna have her ice cream later if she wants to. So this is a really fun, easy, fun Friday lunch. Sorry for the noise in the background. Love you guys. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Please subscribe if you're new. We will see you guys next week. Bye everybody. Written down the words to say It is time I've been waiting for